guys, welcome back to Insane Brit Gaming. I am the Insane Brit, and the new t-shirt uh, is out today, or Friday, I think they're out actually, and uh, so don't forget to check them out, they're in the link in the description below. If you want my meme uh, on a t-shirt, you can uh, help support me and uh, buy my t-shirts, and I think, uh, and a mug as well, I think, and a bunch of other products that I might add onto it as well, uh, even a pillow. I know, it's weird, but whatever. Um, so those links will be in the description below uh, if you're interested in purchasing one of... Um, those. Now, I normally prattle on for ages when I, before an unboxing, giving you X, Y, and Z opinions on it, etc., etc. I'm not going to do that too much. I'm very much a camera noob. Uh, Camcord is my first one. So, um, yeah, it is what it is. So, this is the Sony HDR uh, CX405 9.2 MP4 HD camcorder, 30 plus optical zoom in black. Um, now, I'm just going to give it a basic, like I said, the basic specs, guys, because I not a camera person that way, you know what I mean? So you'll know more than me, probably, or a lot of you will, at least, anyway. Um, if I can just find the bloody specs. Where am I? Where am I? Ah, here we are. <clears throat> so, this uh, resolution, in terms of resolution, 2.3M uh, used for movie external... Ex literally, I'm saying an X more R, uh, whatever that means. Resolution still images at 9.2 and for still images, zoom clear image optical is 60 slash 30 plus zoom. Uh, bit rate is XAVC 50 megabytes per second, wide angle 26.8 millimeter. Image stabilizer is optical steady shot, screen size is 2.7 inch LCD. 230,000 in brackets or whatever. Uh, multiple camera control, it's got it checked, and highlight movie uh, maker easy editing software it comes with. And of course, in the actual box, um, what do we get in the actual box here? Okay, so the box contains camcorder, obviously, rechargeable battery, AC adapter, USB connection support cable, HDMI micro cable, and an operating guide. Now, uh, this camera is about £200. You can buy it from uh, PC World, but they want £5 per month or whatever it is uh, for insurance, which I didn't really want to do, and it adds up to a long, over a long period of time, a lot more money. I bought it on Amazon.com for an extra 20 quid, and you basically get three years insurance, which is great. Uh, one time payment, and then you're done. You know what I mean? You can get two years for 15 quid. I went with the extra fiver. Uh, I will say a few things about this, though. But a lot of people asking certain questions. So, first and foremost, this took forever to get here, by the way. It needs a micro SD card, okay? Um, so that's the one I got for it. Um, 64 gigabyte, which I thought I'd get a lot out of it. It's a good deal. It was £23 on Amazon, so that will also be in the link in the description below. Uh, so you will need a micro SD card before you can even get out of the box and start using it, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, this costs about £30 overall. So that's what I've got. Uh, that's the last thing I was waiting for, actually. This I'm probably going to do, I don't know, I might do a separate unboxing for this. This is a bag that I got with it. It's about 13 quid. That will also be in the link in the description below, maybe. Uh, but like I said, I'll have a, maybe a separate unboxing for that. I don't know. Anyway. <coughs> now, a couple of things about it as well. It's not only the SD card, a micro SD card that you actually need. Um, but you actually, there is rechargeable batteries. Um, and I'm planning to buy a set of four of those for about mm, 15 quid uh, is what I'll do primarily okay now I haven't got hold on let's get in here <clears throat> so yeah that costs about 15 pound I'll put those in the link description below but I'll tell you this much I because it's the same battery supposedly as what's going to be in this camera however I will I do not know that for sure at this point so I haven't tested it is my point you know what I mean that's what I'm saying so if you're okay what the hell is going on here trying to cut it open all right here we are I think I got it more or less <clears throat> and there was another thing I was supposed to say about this camera as well can't think what it was now hmm so yeah like I said the batteries are you know is rechargeable so I will I'm gonna buy more the best thing is to have multiple batteries and then put them in a bag or whatever, and then you're good to go. It lasts about 90 minutes or 100 minutes, but that's if you're uh, on 720, I think. So if you up the uh, to 1080p, you up the quality, it goes down to about an hour. So it's always good to have multiple batteries around you. <coughs> All right, so this ain't too much of a pain to get into. Sorry, I'm just tearing that open. 
packaging, just random. Wow, it looks kind of small in here now. So, removing the box. <coughs> and there it is. I'm liking that. It looks pretty neat, unique, cool. Kind of heavy, a little bit. Um, like I said, it just basically MP4 dual video recording. Not much differences in the box. Of course, you can get the... Um, I don't know if this is the bag I got. I don't know. Maybe. But uh, you can get a stand for it as well, etc., which I may do in the long run. Um, oh, yeah, that's what I was going to say about this uh, particular product. Uh, another big question that people are asking about it is, uh, can it have an external microphone plugged in like this, or a little USB thing that you just put on you like the reporters have, or an external mic of you know the big, the big ones that professional have, and apparently not. You cannot add that in. Now, for this cost about £200, and I thought, for the money I'm paying, that should have came with it standard. Like, come on, that's a, that's a cool feature, a fundamental thing. Would have been really, really nice to have had. And they haven't got it. And what annoys me is you can buy other brands um, that are cheaper but do this, which kind of frustrates me as well. Sorry, guys, there's, there's more stuff in my way. We'll get out of here. We are. <coughs> So we've got a manual. Damn it. Hold on, guys. Give me a minute. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, basically, uh, I had someone disturb me, so I just shut the camera off. Uh, the name of the battery, uh, but like I said, it's going to be in the description below, is the NPBX1. Okay? That's the name of the battery, so just to, uh, just type that into Amazon. But like I said, link in the description below, I'll have uh, X and Y and Z <coughs> in there. Okay, um, sorry, let's continue uh, getting this thing out. Whoa, it looks really small. Okay, so here is the battery. Okay, that's kind of cool. And wires, we have... Hold on. Let's get this out. plug, some kind of plug in there, that's what it looks like, I don't know what they're all for, like I said, I'm a complete noob, so, you know, again, there's a, a, a wire that I assume goes in the plug to charge it, <coughs> and of course, the micro SD cable, um, is that, I assume it's the plug-in to, to the computer, I don't know, again, I'm a total noob, so, you know, I, I just assume that, so what I'm going to do, is I'm going to, um, I'll show the camera in a second, just give me a second, but what I'm going to do is, I'm going to um, put in this, um, this SD card, I'm not going to do it on camera, because it's a little bit fiddly, I want to focus on that, I don't want to break it, I know what I'm like, um, so that's what I'm going to be doing with that, and I'm going to try and show you what it sounds like, and everything else, but of course here is the product itself, Whoa, it's very small. Look at that, it looks small as hell, don't it? It's a little bag. Whoa. And light, that is light as hell. And there it is, guys. Whoa. This is weird. Okay, so like I said, this is my, um... Okay, I've got big hands, so that's going to be interesting. Of course, there's an adjuster. And I've got quite big hands, so you can loosen that up to get your hand in there, and then... Okay. Wow, I didn't even know about that. That's ironic. Considering. And there you go. That, that's just give you an idea of what it looks like. Look, like a bear in my hands. Look at that. It's ridiculous. Okay, so um, there's all these little buttons on top and everything. And of course the screen opens up like that. Whoa. Uh, how do you turn it on? I cannot remember... Because the lighting's kind of bad in here right now, so I can't really see everything. Oh, hold on. Let's focus. Da -da -da. Photo. Oh, here we are. Sorry. On the back, there's a button. And that will be your start and stop, I suppose. And again, it ain't charged, is it? I don't know. <coughs> so it is what it is. Okay, you can... Uh, that's the opener and the closer on the side, just to give you an idea. Like I said, I'm, I'm a total noob, so I don't know how it all works just yet, um, but I'll get to that in a little bit. All right, and I think this can flip out. This, yep, this flips as well. 
So, you know, that's kind of delicate. Be very careful with that, of course. It's not too delicate, delicate, but it is what it is, you know what I mean? You don't want to mess around with that. All right, guys, that is uh, the unboxing. It's very light. I'm amazed at that. And considering the fact I've got big hands, you know, I can find just, just, yeah, that's perfectly fine. I can, big screen, it's perfect. That's awesome. All right, guys, I'm going to try and set this up and then show you some images or tell you uh, my thoughts about the actual putting the SD card in, if it's a bit fiddly, uh, and turn out, figure out how you turn it on and all the rest of it, you know what I mean? So uh, I'll see you then. Sorry, guys, I just realized, this see, this is how much of a noob I am, right? I, I'm trying to turn it on for you in that first part, and it's actually at the bottom. The camera, where did you put the, um, the battery, sorry, is what I'm trying to figure out. Look. It's right there underneath. It's a very like dodgy looking thing there, so be very careful of that. And uh, of course, the battery goes inside. Um, it's not too fiddly, but obviously be careful. But yeah, I was wondering where the hell the battery went, and um, that's essentially where it goes. So that's how you, just to give you an idea. Okay, now I'm kind of worried what I'm doing with this. I don't want to snap it, you know what I mean? What the hell? I assume it's on right, but again, well, whatever. Sorry, guys, I'm just trying to fiddle around with this. I don't trust it right now. <sighs> but yeah, just to give you an idea, you'll have to put it in yourself or whatever, you know, like properly, but whatever. Okay guys, basically um, what I've got here is I've managed to do it and uh, made sure it was in properly and everything and then I'm getting a little screen there and then uh, you navigate um, each part of the menu. So London, Lisbon, yep. Wait, hold on, what have I just done there? No. Okay, that's cool. It's Sorry I'm, if, if you feel like uh, you should be seeing this but it's not, it's just literally to change where you come from in the world and this is ridiculous right there we are next set time summertime what it's not summertime off oh, whatever ah oh, man so display mode and blah 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 that's what it's going to give you all this uh, in the menu just to give you an idea I know it's not very clear there are other videos which show you a lot better I'm not even going to deny this is just a menu setup this is not really important you'll very much figure this out the button itself like this one here it's like a navigator it's like a little joystick so be careful of that but it's not like uh, I'm just saying be careful but it's not bad like it can snap snap easily but I've got big hands remember that guys so and this is I'm, I'm managing to get on with it so if you are I mean, if I am, you will, you know what I mean? Uh, a lot of people got smaller hands than me. Uh, Alright guys, I'm going to go set this up because this isn't really important and everything, you don't really need to be seeing this part of the actual video. Uh, what you want to see is the footage and uh, etc. and how it does outside and stuff like that. So, join me for that as well. Give me one second. Okay guys, the camera is on now. Um, let me just flip that around for you to give you an idea. And look, that's the kind of image I'm getting. Nice and crystal clear. I absolutely love it. Um, it's, it's, it's so simple to work, it is unreal. There's one button uh, that just works everything, and then you just hit the menu, and uh, it's got here, I'll give you some of the options, right? It's uh, shooting mode, movie or photo, standard, uh, camera, mic, um, it's got a bunch of uh, settings here. This is manual settings, white balances on auto, exposure, focus, um, scene selection, picture effect, uh, so you've got a self timer apparently, but I, it's off. Well, obviously, I can't seem to select that right now. Um, what else have we got? Image quality. You can go uh, recording mode, high quality FH. I've gone for frame rate 50i. It's on. Dual video recording is on. File format AVC HD, or you can change it to um, <clears throat> AVX AVC HD. So I'm just giving you, like I said, the file formats. Image size, I went with large, because uh, I had it on small before, but it won't, I couldn't see it very clearly. Um, you can go editing as well, and then you've got general setup. Uh, so it's pretty simplistic, um, but I absolutely love it. It's, it's amazing right now. I can't wait to see what it can actually do in terms of like when I'm recording and out and about. Um, there is also um, something that reduces wind as well, wind resistance. Uh, it basically helps with that apparently, um, I'm not too sure. I have heard it ain't very good in the wind or whatever, but 
then again, I'm not really going to be that much in the wind, but if I'm out and about, I will put that on, and, and hopefully that would help reduce it, whatever. And just in general, I would just try and stay away from uh, windy locations or try and film when it's a little bit more calmer, you know what I mean? But it shouldn't be too much of a problem uh, anyway. So, yeah, that's essentially uh, some of the set settings. It's very unique. Very, I'm, I'm just absolutely loving it right now in terms of the menu aspects of it. Lots of options here. And like, remember, I'm a noob, so you know what I mean? I'm, I'm very much enjoying it. I can navigate very simply. Uh, this is very simplistic. It's a lovely design. It's very light as well. I'm amazed at how light it is. Even with the battery in, I have put the battery in. Like I said, it goes under there. I will need, obviously, spare batteries and stuff like that. Well, guys, what I'm going to do now, um, essentially, is I am going to... Hold on. There we go. I am going to... Um, charge this up. Uh, figure out how to hit the record button. I think I can hit it from here, actually. Am I recording now? What's going on here? I don't know what I'm doing actually. I'll find out how you record and then I can show you some actual footage of it added onto this video. Alright guys, so uh, stay tuned. Okay guys, before we properly test this thing, I figured out a bunch of stuff. Basically the USD uh, card <clears throat> goes in this little slot here. It's a little bit fiddly, but it's not too major. And uh, you just close that up, as well as the micro uh, SD um, cable goes in here as well. So that's not too bad. I have figured out a bunch of things. For example, this is really cool. This 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 button here, right, left and right. I'm like, what the hell is that about? Well, like I said, you may know if you if you're a camera person, but I'll give you an example. There you can see me on the screen. And there you go. Just without even doing anything, guys, I can zoom in. Real, like, look at that, that's pretty awesome. I'm going to show you obviously better. Uh, of course, I'm just giving you a, a rundown right now. Um, of course, as well, there's a button here that says that this is the button left and right, zoom in and out. This button here is the you just snapshot, like you just click it and take a photo of, of a situation that you may think is funny or whatever. Uh, however, I thought that was the same button to record, it is not, blah blah blah. Like I said, I'm a noob. Uh, that button there, that is a record button. So, you know, you just tap that and you start recording so let's give you an idea that is me recording now okay just to give you an idea like I said I'm going to show you it properly um, have I stopped? I think I have but yeah it's really really cool I'm absolutely loving it. Um, it my hand fits in I've got a good grasp of it um, it's just absolutely brilliant I'm absolutely loving this right now let's zoom out a little bit um, but yeah so I'm going to be uh, actually filming around here, checking the mic as well, and um, I'll also be going outside and checking it as well. So guys, that is the unboxing, just to give you a rundown, I know it was in bits and I've just edited this together, um, of course you, there is the editor thing that you have to do with Sony, uh, their website, I will put that in the link in the description below as well, because uh, I have to download it or use it or whatever it is myself, so we'll be having a look at that as well, or I will be, I don't know, and just I'll just give it a website, and uh, you can check that out if you decide to buy this. Uh, like I said, I paid um, £190, it does retail for £200, um, I'm very, very pleased with it right now, I haven't seen no problems, there's so many options, uh, and I'm very, very satisfied, the only thing I'm kind of annoyed at is I can't have an external mic, but other than that, and like I said, the batteries, of the external batteries that I'm going to have to buy, 15 quid for, uh, is a deal I saw, which ain't bad. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video, uh, I, oh actually no, I actually I'll put the, um, the footage on, so uh, stay tuned for that actually guys, because I'm going to edit that bit on as well. So if it seems like a longer video, it is what it is, but I'm showing you every aspect that I can of it. And remember, I'm a noob, so it is what it is. <clears throat> oh guys, one more thing about this, um, I forgot to mention, i just seen, uh, reading for it, this particular wire here, that comes out of the, um, out of the, uh, <clears throat> the grip or whatever you want to call it, uh, that basically is the charge, you can basically put it, uh, you charge it via your PC or laptop or whatever, um, but it will not charge, you cannot record and charge at the same time, which kind of makes sense in a lot of ways to me, however with this uh, cable they give you, or maybe that's, that's the wrong cable, uh, this one, you can actually uh, plug it into a, a socket outlet or a uh, laptop or PC, so that's kind of cool, uh, gives you some multiple options there. That's about it for the externals. Um, that I have to show you really, um, like just as an overview here. But now of course we have to get to the real thing and that is the testing of the uh, outside and actually recording with this where you'll see actually when we're using footage of it. So I'm going to add that on the end of this video as well. Okay, so I'll catch you in that section as well guys. 
Hey guys, one few before. Every time I turn the camera off, I discover something. It is ridiculous. Uh, basically, here is the uh, plug. This is really cool. Um, I didn't know this. Well, I had a hint. Uh, you plug that in there, of course. <clears throat> and then this is essentially your charger. So when you go traveling, uh, a hotel or whatever, you can actually plug this into the wall. So just to give you uh, an indicate, uh, you know, uh, this plugs in exactly with this, which is really, really cool. I love that. What a cool feature. So now I can uh, plug this in on a wall or a wall socket or whatever, and then use the batteries when I'm going out and about, you know what I mean? <clears throat> you know, um, I assume you, uh, you put each battery, if you have extras in there, to, to plug it and charge it, I suppose. I don't know, I haven't got the extra batteries yet or whatever, but uh, that's pretty cool. So just to give you uh, an overview of how it charges or whatever, it just comes together, and you can put that in your bag or whatever, and uh, you're good to go. Alright guys, now I'm going to try to show you some footage of it's actually working. Okay guys, this is just to give you an overlay of how the actual sound works. Uh, this is in a quiet room. My PC is on. I won't even deny that. So that might be making a bit of noise, but yeah. Uh, with the zoom feature, I love this. I don't have to move my camera. And we just want to see Ryuk up there, just say. It zooms in brilliantly. I'm loving that. Look how far that goes in. That is awesome. Oh, I've turned the uh, mic up really loud. So you guys can hear everything, but like I said, this is a quiet room minus my PC, um, you know, and everything. But yeah, so this is just to give you an overview of what the actual, it sounds like, it looks like. And that's really, really cool. I'm loving that. <clears throat> so guys, this is just the inside, uh, where there should be no real <coughs> noise or anything. It's just, you know, me talking, whatever. Picture's absolutely brilliant. I'm loving that. All right, guys, so this is the inside. Um, let's check it outside. Okay guys, this is what it sounds like outside. Sorry it's in the dark, but it's actually pretty good for the night time. I know this is a well lit street, but just to give you an idea of uh, how it sounds outside in traffic, uh, if you were gonna recall someone or something, you know what I mean? It's not too bad. Zoom out, zoom on in to the people there, whatever. But yeah, just to give you a general idea <clears throat> of how it actually is and in the dark it isn't so bad either or semi-dark you know still gives a pretty good picture this is a few months after I've actually got the actual I think this is night modes on I believe this is night mode I believe <clears throat> but I don't I'm not too sure about that so it is what it is but yeah just to give you a decent idea of what it's like actually outside uh, and how it sounds uh, let me know in the comment section uh, if you think it's any good or you've had you've heard better uh, let me know Thanks so much for watching.